you're the musical director of Mr Buckley and Brindy. Could you tell me a bit about how you went about gathering the music for the production? Well, it was very important for me in this instance because the drama is set in such a specific historical period of the 1760s, uh, William Buckley's diaries, was to get music that would directly reflect the period, not just write something that sounded a bit like 18th century music, but research traditional music from the period, from Anglesey specifically, religious music, and also the sort of music that William Buckley enjoyed, wrote in his diary, and got from London publications. So would this be Welsh language music or English language music? The majority of the songs reflect the fact that he was going to the theatre, especially when he took a trip to Ireland. So we've got some songs from John Gates, Beggar's Opera, and one really interesting song that Lewis Morris, his friend, the famous scholar from Anglesey, notated for him in his diary, which is a song called um, Fi Damon Fi by the English composer John Stanley. On the other hand, we do have Welsh music in there, fiddle tunes, that were played in Anglesey in the 18th century. We've got manuscripts surviving from that period. We've also got a carol in there, which was written down in Anglesey by Lewis Morris's brother back in the 1720s. So again, the music actually comes from the location. Can you tell us a bit about the live music you've got going on in the production and who the musicians are? Well, we're very lucky to have two great musicians playing in the production. Gwena Roberts, a marvellous fiddle player from uh, Abergwyn Gregan originally, now based in Cardiff and my very old friend Hugh Roberts, who's from Anglesey. He's an authority on the music of Anglesey. He played the fiddle and luckily also the pibgon and the triple harp. So we've got variety within the ensemble as well. And it adds a lot to the production as well. well I think so. It gives it an extra nous. <laughs> We're looking forward to seeing it. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.